Welcome back peeps and on today's episode of What's Free on Epic we have the captain. Um I have no idea what the game is about. I know I've got a mouse clicker, so let's go. In the year 2255, uh, space is finally conquered by humans as transwarp technology makes it possible to reach distant stars. In the centuries to come, humans discover they are not alone in the universe. So 2225, okay, uh, 2255, I'm definitely not going to lie. Earth reaches out and a collaborative space fleet between the neighboring systems is founded. An age of peace and prosperity follows, and space fleet thrives as its as its foundation. But all is not well in the galaxy, far from Earth. So I gather humans, aliens. Uh, far from Earth, space fleet borders, dark plans are taking. Okay, a distance organization known as the Union. Uh, feels threatened by the rapid expansion of the space fleet. Okay, so space fleet, union, good, bad. And in April, the uh, 3383, they declare war. That is a long time in the future. Soon thereafter, space fleet learns that the union has launched its entire fleet towards Earth. Okay. Together with the fleet, they are bringing an entirely new weapon. Oh, the sun blaster. Okay. Uh, designed to kill stars, it could end all life on Earth in the blink of an eye. Deep in the Utah desert, a new technology secret being developed. The Energy Disruptor Electropulse U Station, or simply Oedipus. Used at the right moment, Oedipus could disable the entire uh, enemy armada and ensure an immediate and complete victory for Space Fleet. I feel like the music's getting louder and louder. To work, Oedipus needs to be charged by an extremely sophisticated and powerful pu fuel cell. <clears throat> One of these cells takes years to craft and prepare. Okay. For safety and security reasons, they are only developed at a distant and secret deep space station. Epsilon. Well then, why are you telling us? plan is formed to use the Epsilon Station's experimental space pole technology to transport all three existing fuel cells back to Earth. On Earth, Captain Thomas T. Welmu is enjoying a vacation with his family. Bruh, looks like baby grew. As a space fleet scientist specializing in space pole technology, he's uh, he is asked to participate in the transport of mission of the fuel cells. Mission day. The elite of space fleet science is present, orbiting Earth. Captain Wilmu is tasked with analyzing the subspace anomaly gate as the, cru uh, the crucial space vault tra transport takes place. Okay, that looks pretty sick. At first the transport seems to go as planned. But suddenly, the flash of light. Uh oh, somebody flashbanged us. Reading the enemy ship behavior in the battle scenario can really help with your battle. So it's a space battle sort of simulator. Okay, starting up. So that must be me. Yep, is that Captain Bull? What, what happened? Ship. Ouch, my head. He looks grey. Ship respond. Great, no power. Power spike must have released the residual current circuit breaker again. Jeff! Jeff! Do you hear me? Uh, guess not. I will have to get back and reset that main fuse. Why the hell am I so hungry? Leave the cockpit. Use this button to highlight things you can interact with. I'm confused. So, 
Oh, okay, so I see it does a little thingy here. So, this is the main computer. Oh, what did I do? No, 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 don't you. No. Okay, so I gotta turn this on and then come back to the main computer. Okay, come on. Look around, drag in game view to pan camera, click or hold mouse button to walk. Okay, so there's a crowbar, that's always good. That's an iconic weapon in every, well, in a lot of games, not every game. So let's see, yes, so door, 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 switch. First things first, oh, that one's broken. Ab door. Let me get the crowbar. Uh, pick it up. Well, what happens if I look at it? Pick up crowbar in this in this introduction. You are guided to your next objective by a sparkling dot. Yes, I'm aware of that. Yeah, pick it up. Uh, okay. Food and medical dispenser. He needs food, so. This is a brand new model I got installed during the last service. Uh, it should be capable of preparing pretty much any dish in known in the universe. Uh, it should also be able to generate all the basic medicines I could need. Okay. So use it. That will not work without power, of course. Okay, so must reset the circuit breaker. Yes. So what? Okay, this is my inventory. Okay, so suicide bolt, delightful crowbar. Okay, so this is. Hmm. There's smoke coming from the door panel. My guess is that this door wouldn't open even with the power back in line. Okay, so that's broken. Sign ya. Food and medical. Observe this. The bio body scanner. Don't stare right into the sensor during the process. Okay. Service droid button. Service droid access pad. Open pair. Oh, okay. Pair. You currently don't have the latest service droid update installed, okay? Please contact your service node for a system wide update, okay? So, um, before I do any of that. Switch. That's not gonna work. Uh, this is the reset button to turn off the alarm. Oh, okay. Uh, of course. Okay. Elevator. It's not gonna work. Okay. Security door. This is a class G security door. Stand clear when closing. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to have to use this to open it. So the elevator, or the, what are the options? Open lab door. Oh. That's cool, little droid. So that didn't work, so, elevator. There we go. Okay, elevator worked. Ah, okay, I didn't read what that said now. Uh, let's see now. Third menu. Yeah. Okay, I just wanted to check. I need to get... Okay, that's. That a hatch. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Uh, it's a service hatch. Maybe I could use this to get a top floor. There we go. Uh, the hatch is open by hand. Okay, so. Just an oil crowbar in mental condition. Box, whatever. 
so how do I okay but how do I do that How do I? Do I drag it? I do. Okay, cool. Now, I didn't use that, did I? Uh, I did. Uh, to get the job done. Okay, let's get this aging body up this elevator shaft. Oop. Okay. So, what do we have here? We've got droid workstation, server rack, bio chair. Okay, hit. You know we're gonna play that. Okay, circuit breaker. Uh, none of this will work. This is the latest space fleet technology in the field of artificial bioconnections. This machine can connect itself directly to the subject's brain and interact it with extreme cost. I don't really know why they installed one on my ship. It's just been released and it's still considered to be somewhat experimental. To be honest, I hope I never have to use it. Okay. This arcade's not gonna work. Yeah, okay, so I can't get in here. There's a hatch there. I'm gonna have to use the droid probably to get in there. Uh, workstation made solely for droids. Server act, this is the brain of the ship. All the data collected during missions is stored here. That's why it's hooked up to the emergency battery. Okay, so... Um, okay, I'm gonna have to use this. I don't think I should mess around with it just for fun. It looks like something the Spanish Inquisition would use on heretics. Okay. I think maybe I have to go back down. Wait, can I just walk past here? Oh, I thought that was a door. I'm an idiot. Circuit breaker for the ship's internal power grid. What is this? That's another hatch. Okay. Uh, same as the rest, it won't budge without some power to the ship. Okay. Uh, startup initiated. Uh, collected memory file standby. Good morning, ship. <clears throat> I must have dozed off. How odd. No, you didn't doze off. We had an accident. Accident. Are you okay, Captain? Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Sorry to have to ask, but what happened? I don't know, really. Uh, we were about to witness the transport mission complete uh, when we... Well, I must have fainted because I don't remember anything else. But your internal power grid shut down, so I had to do a manual reset. The loss in my senses detected was frequency variation buildup from the jump gate. Did we get the fuel cells? I don't know yet. Strange, my system seems to be down. I need to do a system by system restart. This may take some time. I really need Jeff now. He could help me do recalibration of the mainframe. Sure, I haven't seen him though. Uh, do you know where he is? I am afraid not. My internal scanning system is non-operational. Try to contact Jeff directly with your bracelet. I will do that. Bracelet. The bracelet is a common is a communication device around your wrist 
Use it to stay in contact with your ship and crew for input and ideas. Okay, so... Okay. Jeff. Jeff? Captain! It's another robot. Where are you? What is happening? I'm trapped inside the shuttle bay. With shuttle. No, uh, what was that? Is that you, shuttle? I don't believe it's... Jeff? Listen to me. Tell me exactly what he is doing. He keeps turning off the lights in here. And he continues to sound the whole breach alarm. Ah, what's that? Please, Captain, get me out of here. Shuttle, stop it. Please tell Shuttle to turn on the lights. Just wait there, little friend. I have a little robot friend. Fine, Jeff. Jeff seems to be stuck in the shuttle bay. Find him and help him out. Okay. Uh, Shuttle. Shuttle! Yeah? Shuttle, it's Jeff. It's you in the shuttle bay. <laughs> yes, he is. He paraded in here like he owned the lower decks, claiming to inspect the bay doors. As if my bay doors would need inspection. Well, okay. Something went wrong during the transport of the fuel cell. Perhaps the doors got jammed somehow. Just a thought. Perhaps, but uh, stop scaring Jeff, will you? You know he's easily scared. Yeah, that has been tested and confirmed. So let's all act professional here, okay? At this moment, I can leave no such guarantees. Damn, it's shuttle. I'm coming down there. If you say so. Okay, so, arcade, first thing. Let's go. Please insert cartridge. Oh, well, that I don't have a cartridge. Okay, so if I go through this, does it take me downstairs? Uh, it's still in locked security state. Okay, uh, it's Jeff. Let me first see what this does and the server rack. Uh, it's a workstation made solely for droids. Yes, I'm aware of that server rack. Okay. So nothing new there. Um, <clears throat> let's see what happens when I sit in here. I don't think I should mess around. It's fun. Okay. So I should ask Jeff about the hatch. Jeff, if you want to get me out soon, I'm working on. It. Don't worry. I don't know. But I want to go down the hatch. It's locked. Here, say it. I can ask Jeff to help. But I can only do that after I save him, I guess. Um, and I've only got a suicide pole. Okay, so. Go back down, I guess. Ooh, um. Am I in engineering? Let me go main deck. Okay, so this is main deck. This would be engineering. This top one. Yeah. Okay, so then let me, let me go main deck and then check out these other things. Okay, so we've got a door here. Security door. Thank you. Closing. Switch. Turn the alarm off. The ship's fire alarm is fully automated and triggered only by sensors. The switch can only turn off and on going on. Okay, so there is technically no lock going on. Uh, door won't open. This might come from the taxi expert. Should be clear. I can't fix this from here. I need to get to the other side of the store. Um, I guess this is what they call a catch-22. Correct. That is exactly what they call it. I need to get to the other side, but I can't get to the other side unless I get to the other side. Clean. Elevators. It will make them unusable during the cleaning. Okay, I want to see what happens there. Go clean it, little buddy. Okay. Elevators, okay. Food. I'm hungry as fuck. Turning on the computer, done. Spencer, yes, Captain. 
what's on the menu. I'm programmed well to prepare my users whatever they need, sir. So I've heard. Uh, you are supposed to be the most advanced food replicator yet, am I right? Yes, that is correct. I'm adding words here. I am the new Renholster FD3900. Sounds French. Not really. I love the old European kitchen. My database not only contains Earth's entire food history, but also most cuisines from the rest of our quadrant, sir. That is amazing. Okay, okay, so give me a large steak with mashed potatoes, peas, and gravy. That sounds really good. They give me some raspberry jelly coated. No, no, first one. So give me a large steak with mashed potatoes. Of course, sir. Please stand by for your complete body scan. Excuse me? I need to scan you. Why? The beta test that is conducted on Earth showed that a free choice of food would result in an alarming lack of vital vitamins and proteins in the users. So basically, medical management found it necessary to limit the choice of food. So what can I choose between? That is why I need to scan you. Your current condition will determine the menu selection. Stand by, I'll show you. First, I'll scan your body. Scanning. Producing order. This is not what I ordered. No, but it's exactly what your body needs right now. This has to be a joke. All I know is what Scan told me. And your body is drained of proteins, vitamins and minerals. With your order as a general guideline for taste and structure, this is the only thing I have for you right now. According to my programming, I should now have convinced you that this is what you need. Well, you have not. Okay, nutrients. That's a drink. How do I see how my health is and stuff like that? It's a very sad substitute for a real meal. It is a bad tasting compound of what your body needs for the moment. Okay, I shall drink. Now I better drink some of these nutrients so I can perhaps get a decent meal next time. Yuck. This protein stuff really is has not improved. If anything, it's become more oily. So now if I speak to him. Who dispenser? Yes, Captain. Give me what I need. Of course. I just need to scan your body. Hold on. Scan it. So I say, but your nutritional needs are all fulfilled at the current moment. Okay, but no. <laughs> oh, that's so... Uh, that is absolutely shit. So in the future you can't get these good tasted meals just because they're good tasting. Oh, well, that sucks so bad. Okay, so elevator is still being cleaned. Okay. Yes. Good job, droid. Okay, I want to quickly see what other option he has. Um, clean, open, repair. Oh, you currently don't have the latest. Okay. Wait, right, how do I get? Please contact your service provider node for system wide update. Okay. Open, lab door, elevator. Let's see, maybe he can? I don't think so, though. Negative. Okay. What I want to see is service droid panel. No, I want to. How do I. Where can I. Okay, looks like I'm gonna have to just go downstairs. I was hoping I could update him. Oh wait, maybe I can. Um Let me go here. Let me see what this does. Now that I'm back in action. Captain, I'm sorry to report that there's nothing functioning, but at this time mainframe is occupied with a full system checkup you cannot currently use okay so i can't use it uh let me know as soon as it's uh fit for fight i really uh flight oh no it does say fight i really need to participate in the mission agreed sir okay exit yeah so let's go downstairs 
OPV airlock. What is that? That's a door. Okay. Door. Elevator. There's a leak. You know what I didn't do? I didn't go to... Oh no, I need to save Jet first. Airlock. What is this? This is the door to the landing pod vehicle or OPB. I call it shuttle. Short and simple. Okay, so that's where I need to go. Let me go see this. Please don't tell me this is gonna kill me. There's a hatch there or something. Caution, do not. Uh, airlock panel. Caution, do not lock airlock with personnel inside. Okay. Do I kill myself if I open it? Still in a locked good state, okay. Lost it, okay. okay. I wonder if that's where I come out of from there. Okay, so we need to go here. Hey, Shadow, could you open the door, please? Is that you, Cap? Yes, Shadow. It is me, your superior officer. Ah, uh -huh. superior. What door might you be referring to, if I may be so bold? The door to you, Shadow. You have locked it from the inside. Just open it, will you? Don't act stupid now. Well, in my case, it's an act, at least. Oh, wow. Shuttle, open. Easy there, Tiger. Damn, this thing's got attitude. I was sure my hydraulics were acting up again. Well, it's about time to get rid of this int, uh, little intruder in there anyway. But for the future knowledge, I don't like your minions uh, snooping around all over my bay cap. Your bay? Just open the door and let Jeff out. Open sesame. Hey Jeff, what's up buddy? <laughs> oh, Captain, thank you. Shuttle wouldn't let me out. Well, it's a bit... Different. You should discipline him, Captain. I got really intimidated in there. Well, to be honest, Jeff, even though he shouldn't be teasing the crew, you are still a member of Space Fleet. Therefore, one could expect you to. Uh, how should I put this? Well, not to be afraid of the dark. I'm not afraid of the dark, I'm afraid of what's in it. Okay, buddy, I'll talk to Shadow later. I'll try to be strong in the future. Let's wipe off that hydraulic oil leakage and be proud of surviving yet another visit to the shuttle way. There's so much reading! I ho overheard the ship is having problems with some of the systems. Yeah, we seem to have had an accident with transport. We should get the ship back in shape before anything else. Okay. Uh, I'll need to get back to my workstation. Okay, I'll pop with you. Okay, so they're gonna go up here now. To engineering. Let's use it to workstation. There we go. Checking systems. Uh, it looks like we have a short circuit in the lab. No shit. Uh, it's okay. I have to stay here and finish recalibrating the ship. I can take. Take care of the lab program. Okay. Great captain. Uh, oh. Okay, there we go. Thanks. No problem. Uh send you the details to your info pad. Okay, info pad. The info pad is a tablet used by Space Fleet personnel for keeping current tasks and mission briefings up to date. Oh there we go. Okay, so Status. Oh gosh. Two years to attack. Okay. So let me go. Okay, let's open the hatch. There we go. Oh, okay, so you actually see yourself walking through here. So, it's a lab. Hatch to science lab. Uh, 
Tubrak heater by alarm sign. Event. Ship elevators will be shut down during fire use hall spaces for shipwide access. A sink where I can clean my lab equipment after experiments. My test tubes. I can use it if I need to mix some compounds together. I'll just take one. Oh, nice. Okay. Later I can place a test tube in this if I need to heat the contents. Okay. Lab storage. Tubertol extract, dragon oil powder, spore acid, antidote base. Can I just take all of these? What is that? Piece of paper. What it's doing here. Uh, it's a piece of torn paper with the number five written on it. Okay, so I'm guessing that's like a code for something. So I've done that, I've done, done that. It's event to the door. Okay, I think I found the problem to the door conundrum. Uh, there are some disconnected cables behind the panel. This should be an easy fix. There, like making toast. Okay, okay. Uh, I've finished analyzing your surroundings and I've got some really strange readings here. Could you please come to the cockpit right away? Of course, I'm on my way. Okay. Um, but no, I'm not going to go to you straight away. Oh, I could have jumped back in the air, pa air panel. I don't know why I didn't. Um, air vent, sorry. That would have been the easier way to do this. That's your crew quarters. I suppose the door probably can just open. Uh, it won't open. I don't think Jeff has got this one yet. Let's ask him. Jeff? Yes, Captain. Uh, never mind. Okay, I can't. Up stuff. Let's see what the stuff does. So, uh, a small capsule filled with cyanide standard equipment for space fleet. Uh, it's a very sad substitute for, I uh, guess, um, a tube for mixing compounds, a genetic antidote base used to produce more specific antidote, no special effect by itself. Warning avoid skin contact, eye contact, and inhalation. Not that dangerous for children. Okay. Uh, dragon old metal grounded into a fine powder, highly radioactive. Should not carry that around. Extract from the turbulent turtle in five. Okay. Well, I'm gonna end it there, guys. I had a first look. Uh, lots of reading. I'm not the biggest fan of lots of reading in games. I just want to play the games and enjoy it. And you could possibly do that with this. You could just skip through everything but the chances are you'll miss some vital information. So I don't know, maybe I'll be playing this, maybe I won't. Um, but yeah, this was just a look at uh, what's free and epic. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please drop a, a like, drop a subscribe or hit that subscribe button. And uh, yeah, let me know what you think in the comments and I'll check you in the next one.